Hi, thanks for tuning in. My name is Mario and I'm here with Face. And we're going to take uh, the next few minutes to talk about our uh, new EnviroFlow. It's the latest product in our train strain group and we affectionately call it EnviroFlow 2. Yes. It offers significant improvements over the uh, previous channel we had. Before we go into the new features, let's talk for a minute about the things that brought us to dance to begin with. We kept all the things we had originally with the EnviroFlow, right Pace? Yes, Mario, we did. We kept the one meter length. We also kept the recycled polypropylene material, which means that it's very lightweight, easy to handle, and it's very resistant. Now we've also added a, an insert board that's also made from polypropylene material that's designed to function when you pour concrete to keep the debris and concrete material out of the channel, and also used to overlap the joints to help keep the channel straight. That's right. This is very sturdy. You'll notice that we had a little fun here with the lettering. We give you detailed instructions on how this is to be installed. And talking further about the channel itself, you'll notice that the frame has been dropped. It's flat on the sides, and there's a very good reason for that. We're doing a lot of paver installations with the system, and it's paver installation friendly. We now have standard anchors on the channel. There's four of them on each meter long standard channel and that's for you to install it either with rebar or with all thread rod, it works really well. And we've done uh, something totally different about the joints, didn't we, Pace? Yes, Mario, we've made the product as user-friendly as possible. There are no more screws, no more clips to assemble the system. It's based on a tongue and groove uh, design, and on the male end, there is a locator pan, and on the female end, there's a hole in the bottom of the channel for the locator pan to go in. So when you assemble them, um, they're in perfect alignment. We've done the same thing with the closed end caps and horizontal outlet caps, following the same principle. They slide on, and the locator pan um, keeps it in position. That's really good. Now, the system couldn't be complete without catch basins, right? We have yes. catch basins, too. Yes, Mario, you're correct. This is the 9935 uh, series catch basin. It's a half meter. It's made out of polypropylene material, 100%. And on the sides of it, they have a four inch no hub or six inch no hub uh, molded outlet. You just take your whole saw, whichever size is specified for the project, and punch out the ID, then hook it up with a front cold coupling. On the ends of it, we have a female collar that accepts the number 20 channel from either side. And at the end of the run, we also have it designed so that the end cap will insert into it and close it off so you have it finished when you pour. Absolutely, this is really good. Now, going back to the channel for a minute here, we used to have 15 of these sloping and 14 of these non-sloping. We've expanded that range because we wanted to cover more span for most plumbing jobs. So now we have 20 of these channels sloping and 20 of them non-sloping. That's 21 meter, 20 uh, uh, sloping and non-sloping. So that adds up to a little over 131 feet of trench drain. So if you have a catch basin in the middle, you pretty much double that run to 262 feet, which is plenty for most uh, plumbing applications. So we've, we've done quite a few different things here. We wanted just to give you an overview. One last thing that I want to mention here in this brief uh, video is all the grades that you've come to expect from us, from light duty, whether they're in stainless steel or, or polypropylene, going all the way to the uh, extra heavy duty, uh, heavy duty and extra heavy duty grades are still working with this new design. And, and one important feature is the quick lock uh, mechanism, which consists of a stainless steel bar that installs in the channel, as you can see, and it makes for a very quick and easy installation, literally a snap as we call it. That's important for two reasons. One, there's no additional parts that you can lose on the job site, and the installation is very, very quick, not to mention it is aesthetically pleasing. So with that, Pace and I want to thank you for your time today, and we invite you to check us out on our website at www.jrsmith.com, where you can find additional product information, technical uh, drawings, as well as case studies. 